Hello YouTube, this is Puck. Uh, we're under uh, Windows 10 Technical and yeah, you can see my system has not so many apps because uh, most of the apps I just uninstalled. The ones that I could uninstall, I uninstalled them. I kept some, you know, but that's it. And uh, I want to show you um, how stable and how good Windows 10 in fact is. Um, not because uh, the start menu or whatsoever but because it's running all the programs that I until now tested just fine um, things like uh, video editing just fine we showed that in our previous video and now I'm gonna show you uh, that we're also running Android on the system we will go to our task view or extra desktops and we go to desktop 2 and in desktop 2 we have a fully working Android here with uh, the iOS 8 theme you know so I pimped it up a little bit here you can see it I have all the icons on page 1 I don't have so much uh, apps installed although I think I have let me see I think I installed one more app oh it's not here okay I thought I had one more app here I was in fact listening to it uh, that is a very nice app called scanner radio and um, yeah I just installed this to test if uh, Android would run fine uh, under uh, yeah under Windows 10 so uh, you know in my next video I'm gonna show you how to do this and how you can get it just like this because uh, in this video I already did it on this machine and I have another Windows 10 machine that I will also do the same uh, on so um, subscribe to my channel like this video and uh, leave your comment behind uh, if you want to know more about this uh, we do have uh, the Google Play Store let me start it up for you so you have an idea how things uh, work it's almost like in your phone and uh, in google play store you can find any app that you want to install um, in your android uh, we're recording at this moment we're not running windows 10 on a very strong machine we're doing this on the hp 530 it's uh, yeah an old machine with 1.7 gigahertz processor and um, it has uh, I think two gigabytes of RAM so you know I cannot do like really heavy things but you with your quad core computer there you know you can do amazing things with this you know just think of what you could do but um, yeah of course you can run WhatsApp WhatsApp is also uh, well you know let me install it real fast so you guys can see that this is not some stupid nonsense so there it is already what's up messenger there we go let's select it and let's install it because I'm not using it on my phone I'm not using it at all I think what's up is not uh, such a cool surface so if we're gonna install it you will also see what uh, what's up is using from your um, from your phone and now we're gonna see it you see um, in fact uh, the program whatsapp messenger is a very dangerous messenger because um, it you know device ID call information every everyone you call it will know about uh, your Wi-Fi connection information your camera and microphone it can control it you know it can take pictures and listen to your microphone uh, photos media files SMS it can read your SMS knows your locations knows your contact contacts identity device app history what you did uh, what you installed what you uninstalled you know and uh, what you bought so uh, you know we all know that this belongs to Facebook now so you know uh, the workers at Facebook they have exactly the same access to what this program has access to it's just like uh, the messenger the uh, Facebook messenger is in fact just the same 
and uh, there's no way that you can turn it off the only tablet and the only OS that I could find that could turn them all off all these things that it wants to use you know the only OS is Blackberry OS Blackberry OS is the only OS that you can turn like everything off that a app wants to use you know so the app will just run but it will not have no permission to do anything just run on itself and do what it's good for nothing more nothing less so um, that is something that we must uh, of course keep in mind you know if you run these uh, kinds of messengers you know in fact uh, you're just uh, putting your life out there for those that can uh, spy on it and listen and watch and see whatever you do on your whatsapp on your phone even when you're not on whatsapp the thing is running in the background you know i'm not saying bad things i'm just saying it the way it is you know and mark Zuckerberg, i mean like he knows it too he knows what he's doing you know probably he's doing it for the government you know i have nothing to hide for the government but there are people that have a lot of things to hide for the government and these people are on whatsapp talking to little girls you know so what i'm saying is yo you guys there out there you must really you know wake up you know um if you're wondering why you know that guy is following you or that's that certain car is you know everywhere where you go you know or some people uh you don't even know are, are are looking everything that you're doing on the street is because they are following you via apps like whatsapp and other you know um yeah programs so this all is really nice but on my computer here where i install whatsapp i can take out the microphone so this thing cannot do anything on my computer i have no context i have no nothing on this computer you understand so for that whatsapp is good if you want to talk to a, a, to a friend you add this friend of course whatsapp will read your conversations because that is what it's uh, made for you know to read other people's conversations to know who is that person and in fact to uh, get back to that person if you know that person said or typed something that was not uh, uh, against the rules or that was against the rules you know so you know of course if somebody's typing yeah i'm gonna put some bomb there and we're gonna kill uh, 1000 people of course it's very important that immediately action should be taken hey don't get me wrong you know but there are many other things that you know whatsapp don't have to know so you know you uh, using whatsapp or whatever um, you know yeah you're just putting your life outside but no worry everybody does and most people are just sheeps they just follow the shepherds you know and the shepherd in this case is mark Zuckerberg. everybody's following mark you know go mark go mark and uh, yeah so this is it peeps um uh yeah i'm i'm not gonna run uh, what's up uh, at this time it's it's opening it will take time because yeah we're <laughs> we're at this moment running two operating systems and we're also recording the complete session and uh yeah we're doing that in full hd so it takes a little longer you know i know some people they have no patience and they already probably closed this video i split it long time ago but you if you're still here as you can see it works you know agree and continue so here you can just fill in your stuff and uh, you can get uh, what's up running by uh, just adding some friends putting in your telephone number it will ask you to put in your number so in here you will put your number my my number is plus 31 oops 3 oops 31 and eh? yeah and then my phone number I should put in here and then I hit okay you should check your country you know and then put in your number including the little plus and then your country code 
and then uh, you will receive of course you must put uh, a mobile phone phone number and then you're gonna receive a message hey but by the way this is not about what's up man I'm talking so long about what's up this is not about what's up this is about Android on your uh, on your precious little darling on on the Windows 10 you see that and uh, this runs very nice if I'm not recording so at this time it's a little buggy it's a little bit slow you know um, but it works just fine and the apps work fine you know I was listening to my scanner radio here and my scanner radio will uh, turn the screen and make it like a little bit smaller but everything works you know so I just want to say uh, well done uh, I'm gonna close this it's using too much resources at this moment um, all I want to say is is Windows 10 peeps it's amazing it's great to run uh, to be able to run and Windows apps and Android apps you know now we should only find some Mac app player that we can also run but then again yeah I don't see any app from Mac that I would want to run here on this machine it's about Windows and about of course having the possibility to also run Android anyway peeps this was my video I hope you uh, like it I hope that uh, you will get the inspiration to watch my next video so I can teach you how to do this what I just did and how you can also get it in your Windows 10 so make sure to, to support to subscribe to my channel you know and like this video and request whatever you would like to see running in or on the Windows 10 and if I have the software or if I can get it I will show it till my next video bye bye